student business accelerators are mostly synonymous with incubator, if we're thinking about it from the student perspective. More in the um, people out launching businesses right away, it's more of a resource-based perspective than cheap space perspective, which was what an incubator typically is. So a student business accelerator is meant to get students together to give them the resources they need, the mentorship that they need in order to be able to start a business right after graduation while they're a student or 10 years down the road. And it's primarily uh, comprised of making sure that they have resources, mentorship, and facilities that they need in order to give their business ideas legitimacy and to move them forward. So what we found is that anybody starting a business, whether they're a student or whether they're, you know, 20 years into their career and decide to leave that to start a business is that what they want um, is to be able to have a mentor or a coach or someone there to go to with problems or who, are, who have faced or are facing similar circumstances. And so what this kind of facility does is it provides them with people who are in the same situation with them, but also with the mentors paired in, there are people with experience who they can go to and ask questions and get help whenever they need. What we found is that oftentimes on main campus that when we pair a student with a mentor, uh, that mentor has a lot of commonalities with the student across time and so they build a lot of trust and they're able to help those students start their business right away or they're a continued source of confidence for that student until they're ready to start their business five ten years down the road we are very excited about this because we believe this is just one more added value that we have at our campus. Um, a lot of people think that, you know, if you go to main campus, you get all of the added value. Well, there's a lot of things here at the Glasgow campus, and the Student Business Accelerator is just one more opportunity for our students to get plugged in, um, to get the most out of their tuition. We get to, they get to meet with mentors, they get to meet with um, people in the community that have experience with this. So this will be a great opportunity for them to grow their business, to grow their ideas, and just one more added value for WKU. On the main campus, we've had several students across the years, and of course, because students are graduating, it continues to rotate. Uh, but we've had some students start very successful businesses. Uh, there is an off-road uh, aftermarket truck components business that was part of the Student Business Accelerator. They very quickly, within a month, moved out of the Student Business Accelerator because they were so successful. And this was due in large part, right, not only to the resources available that we have, but also to the students' work beforehand. They graduated into an actual commercial space in the Small Business Accelerator and are continuing to expand across Bowling Green. Uh, so what we're seeing is that when students have these resources available, they have uh, more momentum to get started so that they can launch their businesses earlier. I don't know about you, but no one ever talked to me about being an entrepreneur when I was a student. No one ever said, Whitney, you know what you should do? You should start your own business. But now we're having those conversations with students and it's no longer, you should start your business after graduation. It's, you can start your business today and we have the resources here available through WKU to help you do that. And you know, I've worked at schools across the country and really this is an added value that WKU has at both its main and regional campuses that often aren't available on many main campuses across the country. Here we have a lot of class, we offer a lot of classes. So a student can come to the Student Business Accelerator. They can work here on the computers uh, at a desk. They can uh, have this conference space right here if they wanted to meet with another business that was also starting that, you know, they're working together in these four spots. But then if they decide that they need to meet with a client or a potential customer, they can have full use of our conferencing space and then we also have a larger room downstairs that is uh, can hold up to 50 people so if they wanted to do like a, a training or something like that they have more than they can use that space as well and then we also have copiers and things that um, students may not have access to and from their home and really, one of the hurdles to anyone starting a business is to gain legitimacy. You need to look the part. And often for students, that can be very difficult. They're living at home or they're living in a dorm room. And to have a mailing address for your business as a dorm room or you know your home or your apartment doesn't look very professional. And so to have a space like this where you can work, you can receive mail, you can use resources, is such an advantage to them because it gives them a prof the professional look that they need to show clients in order to drum up business.